Hey everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Ari. I'm a Taurus Sun, Cancer Rising, Aquarius Moon, and a Life Half Number 7. If you're not new here, thank you for watching another video of mine and choosing to support me further. It does mean a lot to me. Please make sure to like, comment, and subscribe before you do leave this video, especially if you're able to relate or connect with this reading. So today everyone, I am here with a channel messages reading from your person for all of my Tauruses who are watching. So if you have Taurus as your sun, moon, rising, Venus, or anywhere in your chart, then this reading may resonate or apply to you. So Taurus, your person is whoever is currently on your mind right now. You two may be in separation, in communication, at a distance from one another. Just whoever in your heart is your person, that's your person, and you'll know. Before I do go ahead and get into your reading, Taurus, please keep in mind that this is a general reading for the sign of Taurus, so it may not resonate or relate to you specifically, and if it does not, please don't take it personally. All right, Taurus, so without further ado, let's go ahead and get into your reading. Let's check in on the energy that we have coming towards you in regards to love and from your person. Can we please get a few specific messages for Taurus? What energy is coming towards Taurus in regards to love? And who's this person that they're dealing with currently? Let's get a few more messages for Taurus, please, regarding this energy. How does this person truly feel? What are their true feelings and emotions when it comes to Taurus, please? Let's go ahead and get one more card, please. Okay, Taurus. So, we'll go ahead and take these uh, cards here before I do show them and get into them. Please keep in mind that any energy, feelings, emotions, actions that I'm describing from your person, that could be how you feel. The roles could be reversed, just however this reading resonates for you. Please only take what resonates out of this reading. So towards the first card that did come out, we have natural beauty. We also have, I wish you'd stop playing games and love me straight up. This distance will only make us grow apart. I want to know everything there is about you. You're a mystery to me. You will hear from me soon. This isn't over. I want to protect you. I'd never want to hurt you. And your energy speaks for itself. Okay, Taurus. So I feel like there's this person that you're dealing with. I, I feel like you had a good feeling about this person this is something that got started but has not reached a climax here i feel like as far as really expressing your intentions or this person expressing their intentions that has not been talked about yet but when you start to get to know this person spend time with them i do feel like they were telling you telling you like compliments about yourself and it's it's like you sense the good energy from them and it maybe made you curious Taurus to see what comes comes next and spark that ex that spark that excitement within you but I feel like this person has been silent about what is next when it comes to the both of you and I feel like the reason for that Taurus is they they want to make sure that they're ready, that they go all in on this instead of leaving you on the line. Um, and it, it seems like that's what they're doing here, Taurus, but because this hasn't gotten too deep yet, um, they, they want to make sure that they don't hold you up any longer. And of course, Taurus, if you're expecting communication from anyone that you're dealing with, that is something that you should go, go towards. You shouldn't settle for less. But I feel like you have left this door open because of that initial 
excitement or just seeing seeing what you like within this person within the time you've known them and wanting this to to move forward so you're maybe still optimistic when it comes to this we're gonna get into i want to protect you i'd never want to hurt you i feel like this is this person's energy and as far as protecting you this is why they have not jumped into anything too soon with you maybe there's some things that you don't even know about that they're trying to get figured out. They could be closing, like ending it with anyone else that they've gotten to know so that they could make time, make space for you and so that nothing else comes in the middle of this connection. And they're, it, it's like they're thinking about your emotions too in this and they, they feel like not expressing themselves right now or making that next move is good for this connection because they they want to be able to start it and not not run into anything else not have anything come in the middle and it might be ironic because it's like you started this with me by getting to know me but it's like this person maybe didn't think or feel that they were going to have feelings like they do for you now so it may have been a shock to them that they wanted more with you, but they need to close out whatever else they have going on before they could really make this work. But I feel like your energy is coming through as well, Taurus. You don't appreciate this silence or not knowing what's up. You feel like, I feel like this is a person you've questioned. Should I just completely forget about them? Even if nothing bad happened between us, that silence, it's telling me what I need to know in the moment. And you don't, it might make you feel uncomfortable, Taurus, especially if this person is still around your energy, if you still have contact with them in some way. It could be, in, could be through social media. So, yeah, Taurus, we have, I wish you'd stop playing games, playing games and love me straight up. I feel like this is your energy. And that playing games is maybe going, if this person goes back and forth or if they have not communicated with you, but they're the type to view like what you post or make their presence still, still known. And you might be fed up, you might be tired of it, irritated, annoyed, Taurus. Like really questioning why did you start to get to know me if you're not being consistent? This distance will only make us grow apart. I feel like this is your energy, Taurus. You might be losing interest, detaching from this person, becoming emotionally unavailable. It's like you're optimistic about this person still, but at the same time, you might be putting this in the back of your mind and starting not to care more and more about what happens here. Your energy speaks for itself, Taurus. I feel like this is a mutual energy or this is something you should take for you, yourself and something that this person feels about you, Taurus. And I feel like this is a reason why that you have not pressed this person. You have not asserted yourself because you know what is meant for you. It'll be in your face. It'll make its presence known. So not not settling for anything less than maybe you're good on keeping it as is up until a specific time up until like your personal deadline for them to come come towards you but it's like you're you're not trying hard for this person because they should be attracted to you for you and make make the appropriate moves to get you you're a natural beauty taurus and if this person isn't showing you what you want to be shown um keep in mind that you do not have to go above and beyond for to prove yourself to prove your worth taurus your energy speaks for itself um some people when they come in contact with you as a person or your energy they admire it but they they don't know what to do with it because they're not used to it and this is for all my tauruses who do put out that genuine love who are authentic to themselves they don't try hard or they 
you're a hard worker, but you don't, you're not like the pick me type of person. You're not about to force someone to come to you because you, you know that what is meant for you, it'll come to you. It'll work some way, somehow. So yeah, don't downplay yourself, Taurus. We also have, I want to know everything there is about you. You're a mystery to me. I feel like this is how this person feels about you. Could be a mutual energy here, but I feel like you did not give this person too much of yourself. You, you let some of who you are be unknown because not everyone deserves a seat at your table. So you might be all about consistency here. And as we build this through time, then I'll... I'll let you see all parts of me. Um, and the fact that you're not forcing your energy in this person's face, I feel like that makes them more curious about you, wondering about you more and what you're up to. Because I feel like your stance on this, Taurus, is I'm going to keep doing me. I do want to be involved with you, but there's only so much I can do. And I know that I'm doing everything accordingly. So you have to step up if you really want this. We have, you will hear from me soon. This isn't over. I feel like this is this person, especially if there's been no contact from you. You you have been somewhat MIA, um, distancing yourself from this person in this connection. What else do we have for Taurus, please? We'll take this card that came out. Okay, let's go ahead and get one more card, please, for Taurus. What else do we need to know here? Okay, so Taurus, we have our last few cards. We have, I haven't been the most honest, but my feelings for you were never a lie. To have and experience your love is an honor. And I've never believed in a love like this. So we're going to start with, I haven't been the most honest, but my feelings for you were never a lie. Like I said in the beginning, Taurus, maybe there are some things in the background that you don't know about this person. Maybe it's like they, they didn't, maybe they did lie to you, but I feel like with this energy, it's like they've kept things to themselves. You don't know this person inside and out yet. So this could be a reason to why there has been some delays if this has been resonating with you. So I, I feel like they were trying to make time or they're trying to make time and space for you, but whatever baggage that they have or whatever that they need to clear up, they know that they need to do it before they actually commit to you. We'll get into, I've never believed in a love like this. I feel like this is this person's energy to you, Taurus. And also referring to what I said, people take in your energy, but they don't know what to do with it because they, they've they never experienced something like this before. So they need to get it together. Um, and they, they know this. So I, I feel like that's the main reason for lack of communication here. To have an experience your love is, is an honor. You might know this for yourself, Taurus. I feel like this is how this person feels about you. Um, and they, they might feel like they're on, they're on the edge with you already just because of your energy. You maybe pulled yourself back from this connection because your, your love is not to be played with here. And I feel like if they make the wrong move or if they bring you anything less than then they know that you might detach fully all right let's see what sign you might be dealing with taurus can we please get a sign for taurus cancer pisces so some water energy let's get another sign for taurus please and leo we'll just get one more sign for taurus Cancer again, Leo again, and Aries. So some fire and water energy. All right, Taurus. So I'm going to go ahead and leave it at that for today.
I do apologize my Siri came on, but I'm going to leave it at that for today, Taurus. As always, I appreciate the love and support. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and I will talk to you next time. Bye.